told myself that I wanted to cook more, not as like a 2024 resolution or anything. I don't really make New Year's resolutions, but just in general, I want to be somebody who knows how to cook and can cook really well. I can follow a recipe. I just don't do it enough. So today we're going to cook. That's what's on the agenda today. Body dysmorphia is so real. I don't know if every single girl struggles with this. If you're a girl and you don't struggle with this, like, well, I, I'm so happy for you. I have struggled with body dysmorphia my whole life. This is why it's so important to have a healthy relationship with yourself because no amount of working out and getting your body right or even surgery fillers and all that is going to fix your body dysmorphia like you truly have to be happy with yourself and i've come a long way but it's something i'm still working on like i have days where i'm like dang girl you look good and then i have other days where i'm like cringing at myself and no more of that okay i'm not doing that anymore thankfully it doesn't happen a lot these days like it used to be really bad do you see these abs peeping like that's new for me okay yeah anyway regardless this is why i like to focus my workouts on being active and healthy and the results are just inevitable you know you know i am so sad i just broke a nail these are my real nails you guys hopefully i don't break this at the gym but i'm gonna try to fix this later when i come back don't tell me i forgot my earphones no i also forgot to fill up my water bottle What's going on? What's going on, Janelle? The girl is winded. to do it i should not be eating this right after the gym guys i was low-key lightheaded after the gym and i don't know why like the gym just felt extra hard for me today and then i was lightheaded that normally doesn't happen okay two more two more just look how good this bag is though mm. okay last one picking a really good last one. We'll get fat one. Just a quick disclaimer, this is not a cooking tutorial today we're gonna be making lemon garlic pasta we're making our own sauce from scratch I have made this recipe before it, it's been a couple years um, but I remember really liking it my sauce was too thin like I don't know what I did wrong but we're just gonna hope and pray that it comes out better this time I'm gonna be making two different servings one spicy version and one non spicy version when I told my mom that I was making dinner tonight she was so excited I'm like man I need to do this more often and my boyfriend was excited too. I got these pasta noodles. I'm trying this out for the first time. It is supposed to have 10 grams of protein, so it is a healthier version. We got some garlic, onion, supposed to be shallots, but I could not find shallots anywhere. Olive oil, heavy whipping cream, lemon zest, parmesan. And the choice of protein for this dish is shrimp. That's the first thing I'm gonna do. I'm going to peel and devein these bad boys. Okay, while that's boiling, I'm going to season our shrimp. 
I have so much going on all at the same time. So you're just going to have to watch me, okay? That smells so good. I'm going to add the shrimp now. I'm going to add cheese into the sauce for more flavor and maybe it'll thicken it up. I'm gonna let that melt in there. I took the shrimp out because I don't wanna overcook it. Let's see. So this brand is supposedly supposed to taste like normal pasta, but it has more nutrients in it and more protein. So let me be the judge of that real quick. Okay, I don't think it's fully ready yet, but. It's a lot of flavor in it. A bit harder than usual, but I think that's normal for these healthy pastas, right? Dang. Look at me trying to be all healthy. Is this still warm? A little bit. I would mix it a little bit. You mix it? Yeah. Okay. But it looks so nice with the cheese, though. Um, <laughs> put in everything. Make sure the ratio is right. That's good? <laughs> Be honest, babe. The shrimp are well cooked. Shrimp is well cooked. Okay. Ding, ding, ding. The pasta is well cooked. You know, this is healthy pasta. This is a uh, lentil pasta? No, it's, um, ooh, I forget, but it Chickpea? has like more nutrients in it and more protein. Is it a bonsai or whatever? No, it's, um, Goodles. That's the brand, that Goodles. Part. So it has just as much, um, protein as like the other ones, but mm -hmm. it tastes better, doesn't it? Mm hmm. <laughs> this is dope. I'm getting the kick. I'm getting the, I'm getting the kick from the spice, and then I'm also getting the lemon. Let me try it. Mm -hmm. Now this is good. I'm trying to approved. accept it off. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Would you change anything about it? Just a squig more lemon, but that's it. Oh, it's garlicky. Mm-hmm. So I made two servings, and my appearances is more lemony low-key that sauce is like a little better but I'll, I'll remake it with more lemon but at the same time mm -hmm. this is like the hand the hand mm -hmm. says it all there this you is have it. yeah i ain't even tripping so i need to cook more <laughs> yeah <laughs> I wasn't able to get my parents' reaction on camera, but as you can see, they did enjoy it also. I for reals want to start cooking more, so please hold me accountable. This was really hard to film, I'm not even going to lie. I am a one woman production as of now. Y'all, this is really hard because I'm using my phone as a timer and... Yeah, look at this. Look at all this going on right here. But if you guys enjoyed it, please let me know. I will gladly film more for y'all. It'll be fun recording my cooking journey with you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe.